They're the salt of England, Arthur. Scum. Nothing but beggars and scoundrels. All of them. Gin is the spirit of their patriotism. Yet you expect them to die for you? Mm-hmm. Out of duty? Mm-hmm. Oh, I doubt if even Bonaparte could draw men to him by duty. Oh, Bernie's not a gentleman. Arthur, what an Englishman you are. On a field of battle, his hat is worth 50,000 men. But he's not a gentleman. Your Grace. Let me look at Napoleon. I promise I won't get too near. Mama admires him. I am a little bit of a Bonapartist. Is it true what they say, that he's a monster? Mmm. He eats laurels and drinks blood. And when, my dear Arthur, will you venture into his lair? Hmm? You know, he hasn't given me any idea. It all depends on... Uh, Across the river, tomorrow we'll dry our boots in Brussels. God willing, sire. God, God's got nothing to do with it. Don't let young Hay get killed, Arthur. An engagement? I don't want Sarah to wear black before she's worn white. <laughs> Mama, Dickie's promised to get me a Caress's helmet as a work basket. Without any blood on it, Mama. And one for me, young man. With the blood. Where do you intend to stick your Frenchman hay? I thought under the right arm, sir. See, Mama, he has a plan. When you meet a Carassier, knee to knee, you'll be lucky if you bring away your life with you. Never mind his helmet. Boy, you'll learn the art of fighting from the French. Madam, I believe I've never seen such a set of sprats. General Picton doesn't even know how to walk in a ballroom. But he's very good when he's dancing with the French. But one dances with them in a field. 
That gentleman will spoil the dancing. It's Napoleon, sir. He has... I'm aware, Muffling. Napoleon has crossed the border. With all his forces, he has come between both our armies. Where? At Chalwa. Chalwa. Do you wish me to stop the ball, Arthur? No, 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 I want no alarm. All of us as obliged ladies will finish the dance. Axbridge, move your cavalry immediately towards Charleroi. Picton, your division will march out tonight. in Spain. We've had so little time together. But, Madeline, a battle is no place. I'm frightened. I may never see you again. On his right, he should be you on his left there by now. He should have come by Mons lodging. What could be simpler than Charles? He's humbugged me. In a night's march, he's made us piecemeal. I must concede he's gained a victory at the cost of bootlaces. If Marshal Blucher stays in Belgium, I stay too. On that promise, Lord Duke, Blucher would tie his men to trees if necessary. These four roads here. Quatre bras. He's bound to go for them, sir. If we can't hold him there. I'll stop him here. Shall one? By God, that man does war on us. Glory is never a pretty sight. 